Hello and welcome once again to Rimworld. So I'm going to speed straight up. It's been a couple of days since I last recorded, so uh, you'll have to forgive me that I cannot remember what I'm doing. And uh, I don't unfortunately have time today to sort of review the old episode before doing this one. Um, a lot going on unfortunately at the moment. Extend that stockpile. Uh, but today I definitely want to build a bit of a defensive wall. Um, because I, I want to start getting, if not a kill box, then at least something up and running that we can sort of use to defend ourselves. Because uh, we've got all these guns and stuff, uh, like the, the laser turrets, so it would make sense to set up a defense, especially considering um, the game isn't being nice to us too much. So having some defenses, probably a good idea. Now, I think the largest I can have is like an 11 uh, wide. Okay, so then I want quite a long kill box this time. 25. Yeah, that'll be fine. A meteor of hardened foam wall. Okay, that. Right up. That's probably one of the weirdest things I've seen crash down. I mean, I could just extend that right the way up to the edge, couldn't I? Give enemies no choice but to walk through it. Yeah, you know what? I'll do that. And then we'll have a single one wide hole for them to get through on this side. Yeah, I love that idea. And a limestone door. Just there. Now, we are going to take a little while actually building this. Um, we obviously don't have all the materials at this precise moment. But it will keep my guys busy at least. Uh, I'm also going to have to worry about power. We only need power up to there because for the moment this power will just have to run outside. There we go. So that will get power into this area where we can install our guns. I might double or triple thick this wall. Oh, and Hugh is leaving. Well, I hope you appreciate that we didn't kill you. Thank you, Lippy. Probably gonna need more stone made. I suppose whenever we don't have anything else to do, Lippy will start that at least. Wow, there is a lot of compacted steel in here. Which is a good thing and a bad thing all at the same time.
I think even if partially this wall is completed, like just that one edge, at least then we won't just get instantly destroyed by raiders. We could even set up our guns just outside here, um, you know, for just in case moments. That bed, reinstall it just there. Because where it currently sits is kind of stupid. Thank you, Thank you very much. May as well add that to our stock room. Lippy. How about we put crafting on a two for now? So that you go and actually do some of that rather than building work. Because uh, Target can handle the current building work. And John is doing quite nicely making us some food. increase that. Yeah, let's go to 40. Pause when we get to 20. Or pause when we get to 20, pause when we've actually got 4. But you got what I meant. Oh, you're playing horseshoes. Perfect. You make those bricks. Thank you. Oh. Tell you what. Storage. Clear all. Manufactured it'll be, I think. No? More resources? Stone blocks. No. Okay. <clears throat> so Lippy won't bring them all the way out here then. Uh, he'll just put them there. Which is going to be much quicker because it doesn't have to walk as far then. Now, I do kind of want the dining room. Obviously, at the moment, we're not using one. and I mean, we do have these tables here, so it's not too bad. I think a dining room might fit here quite well. So sort of double rooms length, same width. Yeah, that'd probably be all right. So these are eight in length. So eight high and that wide. That'd probably be fine for a dining room. Oh no, Lippy, I don't want you digging that yet, though. It's not actually important yet. Just uh, make the materials we need to build walls. Need warm clothes. <clears throat> that might be something we actually have to work on soon.
Bad temperature. Ooh. Okay. Let's get a heater built in every room. Or the majority of rooms. And I suppose we can also have one just there. If you could prioritise that heater, please. Need one component. Why is that rice? Okay, perfect. So that should help raise the temperature in this place a little. Eventually this place will be built up properly. keep thinking maybe we should deconstruct some of the beds because <clears throat> we're never gonna use that many beds and they're all made of silver so money but I don't want to oh dear we started with them and I want to keep them psychic like suit well thank you very much That would definitely make some of our colonists happier. Uh, oh, we need wood for it. Well, we have some wood. Actually, we have quite a lot of wood. Target, how about you uh, prioritize that tailor's bench? We're up to 135 stone, nice. Wonderful. Could just make some parkers. I think four in stock will be fine. Um, get pants as well. And t shirt. Yeah, that was many do these take each? Five. Okay, so we can probably get quite a few walls built out. In which case, I'm going to drop crafting back to a three for the minute for Lippy. So Lippy will help build all of the blocks. That'll double our speed. Ooh. They'll drop components. And an eclipse. And a mad raccoon. That's probably gonna go and attack Banzo. Really? That's just. So it didn't bother with him and it just came to us. Alright, you're not allowed out for a minute. Not until all of you are awake, and then we'll just go out and shoot it all together. You're all in the wrong bedrooms. <laughs> oh dear. Right. All of you, come stand there. Yeah, keep shooting. 
or out. In fact, go beat it up. There we go. Thank you very much. Jeez, that's most of the blocks gone. They disappear real quick. Like, we had 140 of them. And they're just gone. Okay, so I suppose you can uh, once again do crafting as your priority. I'll get some of the heat and built, nice. You did 20 at a time? I have no idea because it target nicked them all at the exact same moment. Yeah, it does 20 at a time. Wow, that's pretty good. That's four pieces of wall. Although a door requires 25. Jeez. You know what? I can't really complain. It's getting nice and warm in here, thankfully. We probably want a vent. Put it opposite the door. Because although I want a heater in every room, I do want the heaters helping the overall base as well. So otherwise, you know, the heater just heating this room, kind of pointless. Oh, we had a zit event. And it tripped out one of our circuit breakers, I believe. Oh, yeah, look, it tripped that circuit breaker. So they just need to go and flip the switch. Oh, that's amazing, I love it. I love not having batteries that can go bang. Or, well, the batteries could still go bang, but. Uh, John, could you just haul that one piece of steel out of the door? Because. It's getting cold in here for no reason other than the door is open. I'll probably be able to replace all this soon as well. Once those four bits of wall there are done, oh, we still got this stuff. Yeah. Hopefully that will get done soon and then we'll actually start building the proper defensive wall. We're getting a bit of a stockpile of this stuff. Probably a good idea leaving Lippy on crafting. I do hate that the skills constantly tick down. Did it just keep going down? I have no idea. It doesn't make me laugh as well that some things don't tick down, but other things do. 
I know that it goes back to like whatever level it was starting at, but it's still annoying. Right, so you're on 92. Sorry about the house phone, guys. Uh, I can put my mobile to silent. I can't really uh, do anything about that, unfortunately. Um, but yeah, it looked like your skill went down. Like, I, I don't understand how... Unless it just went up so much that I didn't even notice. We'll grab another rock. Okay. 6,075. Does working on that not affect crafting? Okay, um... Maybe stones don't affect crafting. Which is silly, really, because it's still crafting, it's just... Okay, so... 5347. Oh, okay, so it is going up with mining. Okay, so maybe just crafting stone doesn't affect crafting skill. Again, I think that's ridiculous because you spend so much time doing it. Mm. Oh well. I suppose I can't complain if that's just how the game does it. But I think that is where we're going to end this episode, guys. So I think once this starts getting built... Uh, oh, you got murdered. I wonder how. Hypothermia. Okay. You are wandering around, I think, naked. Yeah. So it's not really hard to imagine why you died. I don't think I had actually started a graveyard yet, had I? <laughs> okay, well, we will now. Um, I was going to end the episode, but, you know, stuff happens. That's a power. I don't really want to cover that over because I would like to use that. I suppose we can have a, a small graveyard here. So. Ah, damn you. There we go. A small graveyard. Uh, what I was going to say is hopefully in the next episode we'll get some of this defensive wall set up. Then I can start adding in the laser turrets and the energy turret. And at that point we will have a pretty solid defense. I just hope that these don't get destroyed very quickly, because we don't have unlimited amounts of them. Uh, I mean, what? We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven laser turrets and one energy turret. So yeah, I don't want them disappearing too quickly. But uh, thank you very much for watching, guys. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I shall see you next time.